A cabbie ended up in cuffs for allegedly trying to steal a passenger's iPad. And a popular app helped police to make that arrest. News 12 Long Island's Christine Inzinga has the story you'll see only on 12. Ah, uh, the iPad, prized possession of so many these days, including this man, Chris yeah, Macrod. He's asked us not to show his face, but says he left his iPad in the back of a cab early Friday morning and was shocked when he tried to get it back. I called the taxi cab company and they said nothing was turned in. Luckily for Macrod, he had just uploaded a new app to his iPad last month. For some reason, it's called the Find My iPhone. And yeah, it works on those too. If it's stolen, I could control it from my house. I could lock it, put a message on it. Two days later, in this Lindenhurst computer store, Robert Putney says he waited on this customer who was captured on surveillance. He had an iPad that he told me had been abandoned in his cab for several weeks. No one claimed it and it was released to him. He wanted to know if Putney could help him set it up, get it online. But the second he did... It instantly said, this device has been tracked, it's stolen and he gave me a phone number to call. Putney told the man he would just call the number and try to straighten the whole thing out. But the man, who cops have now identified as Chris Stoyak, got agitated and told him not to. But when Stoyak left the store, the shop called the rightful owner. The next day, Stoyak the cabbie was in cuffs, thanks to the app. Well, that's fantastic. And, you know, instead of just, there's a lot of frivolous apps, so this one actually uh, saved someone a few hundred dollars. So that's nice to see. Christina Nsinga, News 12, Long Island. Pretty amazing. Stoic has been charged with grand larceny. He's due back in court Monday.